Yao Ming called me one day after I got released from Miami. And I thought somebody was playing on my phone because mm -hmm. he never calls. <laughs> so he was like, John, this Yao. I said, ah, oh, yeah, <laughs> hung up the phone. <laughs> calls me back. He said, no, 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 it's me, John, it's Yao, it's Yao. <laughs> I was like, what's up, big fella? He was like, hey, I, I just brought my team in China. I want you to be my point guard. And I was like, China? Like, this is before, like, yeah. I didn't know nothing about China basketball. So I was like, all right, y'all. I was like, he was like, well, how, how, how much would it cost for you? I was like, 85 a month. I just threw a new guy. He was like, okay. <laughs> he was like, so I had to fly home mm -hmm. to Houston, get a visa. Woke up a day later, I'm in Shanghai. I'm like, what the? Loved it. Fans, them. Loved it. I was in Shanghai, it's like New York City on yeah. steroids. I had a driver. I had a three bedroom condo yeah. downtown. Like living like a king. My face is on the billboard everywhere. I couldn't walk nowhere in Shanghai. I had they gave me another nickname. I was called <laughs> Wizard because I did magic with the ball. You know they got all kinds. Of, and I was like Lucasan, 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 Jayo, Jayo, like Jayo. Like, I so. said the same thing. Like when I went out there, it made me fall in love with basketball again. Like they, it's like it's all love. It's positive. It's just positive. there's no negativity. At there's, all. there's so, is there one catch though? You got to score. It's yeah. on volume. It, but if you're a scorer, it doesn't it, it, matter. It, but what I'm saying yeah. is, like, for just, they made you feel like you were Kobe Bryant, right? Man, no, I, I called home and I told everybody, <laughs> like, yo, after league, Me? I'm <laughs> good. Okay. I said, I am good. I got every game I win, it's an envelope, yeah. a cake. <laughs> mm -hmm. yeah. If I make the playoffs, that's another 70K. Bonus. If I get past the first round, listen, I'm kind of, I'm like, did, did, that what I would make in a year, yeah. it, it, in the league. In a year. And it's tax and it, free. And this is a couple months. Co mm -hmm. And I, I'm only there four months. So it's tax free. So I'm over there killing. I was like the only small guard there because they always kept big guards. Mm -hmm. Right? So my first year, I was the only small guard there. He, it was a point guard and I had a big man. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Everybody else had two bigs. Thanks. So I was a small guard. So I was averaging like 30 some for it, but having fun with it, you know, I got commercials, I got <laughs> sponsored. I was, then I got sponsored by Lee Ning. So um, I'm over there, I'm like, man, forget the league. I'm cool. So I started doing my own agency. I'm like, all right, I made this, like, y'all want me to come back? You know, we do the numbers, I, you know, I do it. So <laughs> I, I ended up doing it. I'm flying back home. I, I it came such a hustle to, like, not a hustle, but I, I embedded because, you know, I'm looking over there. You're going to know this and you're going to laugh. I was like, oh, you, like, you can really take it by storm. Like, how Marbury's doing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All you have to do is buy into the culture. Yeah. See, when Americans get over there, they uh, you yeah, know, yeah, try to yeah. act all I was American. Like, they try yeah, to act all American. But that, that was the thing for Marbury at that time in his life and his career. He needed that. He and then me. when he got there, he bought in because it was new. It was fresh. And you said it was all love. Yeah. That's what I said. It's like, but just hearing him, you see why some guys who go over don't to China back. don't come back. Don't come back. Because right. you you were the Michael, you you were Kobe, like how Kobe and LeBron and they be chasing him down the street. And you go over there, you're the 13, 15 guy, and you watching all the fans over there, and you sitting there walking through the hotel, and then you go to China and you are that. Mm -hmm. It's hard. It's hard because it's this, well, hard. the route you took, like you said, if you're the 13th, 12th, 13th guy, and you're you're disengaged with the game, you need that. You want to be at the. But front. that's what I'm, saying. I'm. I'm a star in the NBA, so I, I'm, yeah. I'm I'm getting this. Mm -hmm. When I went to China, ten times. I'm sitting here like, man, I'm good. I'm like, that's why, that's why China's my last. I'm good. Yeah. Like, I'm good. Like, if I didn't keep getting hurt, I would still, I'll be over there. Because it was, it's, it's like, I walked through the mall. Picture, 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 photo, 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 photo. Like, <laughs> just million, like, it was just unbelievable. Go to the airport. I mean, they're chasing you down. Like, yeah. like, it was like, like, this is what the cold feel like. This is what Jordan Yeah, like, you get that. Well, I'm Michael feeling. Jackson out this yeah. <laughs> Like, I got that. I'm like, anything I wanted. Yep. If I want to go to Hong Kong for a mm -hmm. week, oh, business class. Yep. Go. Oh, come back. 
<laughs> or, you know, practice it. I was like, oh, I'm kind of sore. They uh, bring somebody in, yeah, fix you, fix me all up. And while all my teammates out there running around like crazy, I'm on the sideline, and I used to feel bad to yeah, do yeah. it. So I'm like, nah, let's just do it at the condo, yeah. and you know, because I, like, I've always been like, those was my guys. Mm-hmm. I still keep in contact with all those guys that I played with in China. Like those are my mm-hmm. brothers. Yeah, yeah. And you know, the money wise is different. The way they make their money is different. So we had Morton's, Roof Chris, uh-huh. and, you know, all that. So I used to be like, hey, come on, I got it. So we like, but to me it was about bonding. Mm-hmm. And they love basketball so much over there. It's crazy. So when I used to come back, I used to be like, man, cool. Like my agent be like, oh, so and so wants you to bring in for a workout. I was like, is it guaranteed money? I ain't going. I'm like, all right, I'm cool staying in China. <laughs>